wherever you are on this most pleasant evening. There has been a clamour to get inside the ground tonight for a much-anticipated game. The uh, roads outside of the stadium have been bumper to bumper with traffic. The car parks are full. There is a torrent of humankind making its way from the nearby station. And we expect every seat to be filled. An atmosphere of uh, great expectation and excitement. As we survey the stands of the Maracanã, what a sight it is. A terrific sight, a wash with colour, as always has been the case. Pivotal. Yeah, Kylian Mbappe, there's nothing more frightening for a defender when he's running at you at full speed. He gets into a stride so quickly and seems to just glide across the turf. But when the goal's in front of him, he's also got that cool head that's required to, to pick a spot and finish everything off. Not to disagree with that, it is the sort of situation he thrives in. we go then. Tony Kroos. Just brushed off the ball there. Bovo. Defending, albeit from an unexpected source. Well, they say that your front lads should be that first line of, uh, of stopping the opposition. And I think he's taken it to another level with his desire to get back and, and help everyone out. Mbappe. McLean. Breaks on here. Dmitry Komarov. Hoists it high. Has a hit! As United know they can rely on the counter and they've just expressed a warning. Vinicius Junior. McLean. Rudiger cuts it out. Bale. Valverde. And it's Tony Kroos. the last thing they wanted to do. Well, I think the alternative was to stand there and, and do nothing while he, he tried to score. And obviously, he's not going to allow that to is he? Madrid take the early advantage. Colaccini. Anita. Colaccini. Anita. Forward it goes. Oh, well intercepted. Really alerts the danger. Vinicius Junior. Real Madrid couldn't do a whole lot with it there. They could do with more sharpness in their passing. 
Bovo. Colaccini tries to get it forward quickly. Oh, what a ball! Hoists it forward. Tony Kroos. Just to point out, Peter, that the fullbacks are quite high. And what do they try to achieve? Well, it's obviously a move to push um, the opposition wide men back and, and give them more to think about. And a shot! It's off target and by quite a way. OK, it's come to nothing, but it's a warning of further threat on the break. Same. The decision is fatal. Valverde. Rudiger plays it forward. Valverde. Towards the middle. Just needed to be better than that, and he knows it. Tony Cruz. Valverde. forward and out to safety that is as far as they're going to go Tony Cruz Vinicius Junior Valverde Vinicius Junior Ball, it's found its target. Away from immediate danger. Hit long and direct. Colaccini. Tries to get it forward quickly. Forward it goes. Dmitry Komarov. It's a loose ball. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. Well, the crowd clearly like what they just saw. Some real no-nonsense defending. Vinicius Junior. Bovo, Colaccini, McClay, that's the through ball, that's a pop, it's a goal! Yeah, looking back at that, that's how you play on the counter, quick and decisive and ruthless with the finish. I thought it was a stunning, stunning breakaway.
has certainly made things interesting. Well, if anyone in this stadium thinks they haven't got value for money, I give up. Valverde. So, midway through the first half, and it is a tight old tie. Foot in. Floats one over. Looking for a decent ball in. Alia. Dmitry Komarov. Bovo. Anita. Dmitry Komarov. McLean. Over. Valverde with a good steal, well played. Bale. Vinicius Junior. Chance to break. Rudiger gets into the right position to intercept. Valverde plays it forward. Vinicius Junior. Danger averted for now. Pops it in gently. Hoists it forward. Vinicius Junior. Finds himself eased off the ball. Dmitry Komarov. Salas. Good spell of possession, this, but very little to show for it. Forward it goes. Let's put a stop to that. Vinicius Junior. Dmitry Komarov. Gets it back. Dmitry Komarov. And now they can launch a counter. He's found his man. Look, I don't want to sound too dismissive, but from here, that looks a harder thing to do. Mbappe. He's got to work. Mbappe! That's caused the worry or two. Well, to put it this way, he's probably made better decisions. And it's played forward. goal then well I thought once he got the first part of it right by getting his knee over the ball it was always likely to be drilled very low and so it proved This is what we've been waiting for. Yeah, they deserve great credit for turning things around, but they'll now need the defensive resilience to equal that attacking flair. Dmitry Komarov. He's made sure that that won't get through. Valverde. Still a little short of forward momentum, lacking thrust. 
Coming up to half time, leading, and things are looking pretty good. We are throwing. That's not going to go down too well with his teammates. Bale. Vinicius Junior. Is there a goes for goal! Oh, so close to what would have been a memorable goal. I just hope he won't let the failure to score affect him with the ability he has. He can reproduce. Hoisted clear. Close, it's good distance on it. Dimitri Kobarov. Salas. Dimitri Kobarov. No foul, says the referee. Rudiger. Bale. Forward it goes. Did really well to intervene and dispel the growing danger. Mbappe. A great ball. Chance! That's just a great finish, but it's down to very clever movement. You can see this has been obviously worked on on the training ground. He knew exactly where he wanted the ball, and it all came good. Quite a thriller this one's become. Well, they just couldn't have responded any better, Peter. Yeah, there's the old cliche about how teams can lose focus after scoring, but you still have to take your chances. Brilliant. Dmitry Kobarov. Salas. Konko. Here it comes. And it's half time here. And it has been a pretty crazy game so far. They played out in extraordinary fashion and the scoreline overlines that. It's kind of a hard one to call, Peter, isn't it? I mean, from what we've seen so far, both sides have provided ample evidence that they can add more goals. And I'm sure their respective managers have reminded them that the next one 
will be pretty crucial. So it's going to be interesting to see how the teams come out for the next period. That's a good half. They've gone blow for blow, and it's 2-2. So we're just settling back into this second half. More than happy to take the muscular approach. Colaccini. It's come loose. Gets wrestled off the ball. Bale. Vinicius Junior. Mbappe. Salas. And the weighted pass. Dmitry Komarov, Konko, Anita, and the shot! Try and come good, so it's a bit different. That's a little unfortunate, he had a lot of people worried about it. Valverde. It's a bit of penetration to go with all this possession. Vinicius Junior. Aimed in towards the centre. Last ditch defending, but that'll do. Bovo. Goes direct to the front line. Rudiger. Colaccini. And helps available out wide. He's got the ball glued to his feet. One way of trying to make things happen. There's a few who could follow that example. Tony Kroos. Tony Kroos. Bale. Vinicius Junior. Loses his balance and loses the ball. Certainly caught him there, it's a free kick. That always appreciated by the crowd. You have to admire a commitment like that because he could easily ignore that, just kind of walk around and let others do all the chasing. But instead, he looks as if he relishes the chance to, uh, to dig in for his team here. Tony Kroos. Valverde. Hoists it forward. And here's the chance to counter. Gets the better of his man. Oh, that's a fine challenge. Has a hit! It was a matter of inches.
Valverde. Oh, that is lovely footwork. There are a few waiting for it. Big chance! chances together here. Taking one can only add to such good momentum now. Close ball short. Close ball. Who's going to get there? A chance to play it in. It goes back. Vinicius Junior. Now the counter. McLean. Plays a clever pass. Battles to win it back. We could assume that they've been instructed by the boss to, to stay in attack. They're just looking to break, aren't they? Yeah, the key now is just to get the ball to them as soon as possible. Valverde. Vinicius Junior. Bale. And it's played forward. Mbappe! Well, he should have got better, and he knows it. Mbappe did give it a fair old crack, and he'll be encouraged to step up again. And it's played forward. Just well to step in there. That was more than necessary. Dmitry Komarov. Referee has given a corner. They've played it short. All driven towards the far post. He's had a go! Oh, just lacked a decent finish. Well, Peter, I would say it was worth a try. Hoists it forward. Salas. That's great strength on the ball. Dmitry Komarov. Colacini. Prost is there to heave it away. On a charge. Oh, that's neat. Colacini. In towards the middle. That intervention was very necessary. Shot a goal! A collective sigh of relief from the defence. Forward it goes. It'll be a throw in. Valverde does well to read it and intercepts. Rudiger.
Bale. Vinicius Junior. Out to the right. Can he deliver? Regardless of the outcome, it is good to see someone running at the defence like that. Opposite number. A reprieve, albeit perhaps momentary. He's in, surely. Plenty waiting in the middle. That's a bad place to challenge. What's he giving? And the referee has given a free kick just outside the box. Well. It was deliberate, it was cynical, and you have to understand the frustration of, of being denied a clear opportunity, but it had to be done. That is good defending, it's been repelled. Real Madrid merit full marks for their attitude and application in trying to win this. It means an awful lot, obviously. He tries to get it forward quickly. Valverde. Vinicius Junior. Real Madrid showing a good level of intensity at this stage. They're calling on all their resources now. Modric plays it out to the flank. And it's Modric. He's going to have to go it alone. Madrid take the lead. Well, I think you can write this lot off at your peril. It's been a joy to watch them hold themselves right back into it. Now, can they hang on? Courtois sends that a long way. Conco. Salas. Pez United are definitely not going down without a scrap. Their attitude just can't be faulted. Going for goal! Good contact to hold them. Well, the level of urgency is shot up, and, and that's promising now to maintain it. Changes then in quick succession. So we have a double substitution going on here. Well played, he saw that coming. A leveller or the knockout blow. Either way, it's got to happen right away. Well, it's looking like too little too late, but they are giving it all they have. Bit of an appeal, but nothing doing. Keep calm and carry on. That's the job in a nutshell now. Could move up a gear here. 
good ball. Get that clear. Will be a throw in. Tries to pick out a ticket. Gets his head to it. Just couldn't turn it in. Really good. Can defend those situations better by stopping the cross in source. Real Madrid making another change here. Well, he's worked so hard for his side, uh, as you would expect, but you couldn't help notice that he was starting to, to labour a bit, so it's no surprise. Pez United need to give it... And the shot! It's there! Dying minutes, and we're all square again! Simple finish in the end. What do you think, Jim? Well, to his credit, he managed to ghost into space to, to finish things off, but the failure to spot him was, was ghastly defence. So all square with almost no time remaining. There's only one word for this, it, it's baffling. That team needs to figure out where the ball needs to be and it's not there. Balls out on the left now. And that has been clubbed away. Been one straight back. Modric. Valverde. You wonder if that's it now, but there may be one more opportunity, Peter, for a late, late steal here. showing that there will be three minutes of added time. Striding forward, facing goal. Vinicius Junior looking to break out here. Plays it through. Modric. Modric plays it in. Valverde. Modric. Shapes to shoot! Coming. Aquilani. Hector. Dmitry Komarov. It is going to need 30 more minutes. No winner after 90. Yeah, no daylight between these two sides, but I have to say, neither side really did enough to find the winner. They just cancelled each other out. Fitness and fatigue, the key factors now as we head for extra time. So our quest to find the winner continues. Tony Kroos. Hoists it forward, right through the middle, and the counter is on. He's in! Yeah, he was under pressure to get that exactly right, and he couldn't even think of the consequences. It was instinctive and rock solid. Loses his balance and loses the ball. Coming. Dmitry Komarov. Quickly. Oh, he 
acknowledges that he should have come up with something better there. Look, he's offering an apology to his teammate, who's clearly miffed at not being picked out despite making what looked like the right run. Dmitry Komarov. Modric. Valverde. Forward it goes. Dmitry Komarov. Hits one! Deflection may or may not have made a difference. Little matter, it is his. So we have a breakthrough. Now, how will things develop from here? Brahim Diaz. Plays it over to the other flank. Valverde. And it's Modric. Played out to the right. Tosses into the box. Leave it clear. Valverde. And it's hoisted clear. Oh, they could break here. Modric. It's Modric! He stays intact just. Modric nearly produced the perfect retort. That can only be a means to have another go. Raheem Diaz, Tony Kroos, Novo, and it's played forward. This is promising. Mbappe really got caught in a trap there, and he just couldn't get out. Aquilani. Work on the right flank. Now, what's next? No, too much on it. Tony Kroos. Rudiger. Half time, extra time. Oh, what a comeback. Certainly, I didn't see that coming, or I think did many in this crowd. Well, it may well be a case of who's got most to give now. Fitness levels look good, and it's not only less competitive. Is there to be drama in these final 15 minutes? They have played themselves to a near standstill. What is left in the tank now? about the quality of the delivery and they come away with nothing good challenge he just stood firm Brahim Diaz tries a shot
Silva. Has he found his man? Good defending there. They've slammed the door in the faces of the opposition. Brahim Diaz. He's had a shot! Oh, that is rather wayward. They're probably getting frustrated by the lack of chances, I suppose. I've got changes here, from both sides, in fact. Modric has created one goal already. Mbappe. Mbappe! He was not concerned by that. Well, I can understand why his thinking was that way in front. Forward it goes. And it's been taken straight back. Here it is now, short, up he gets! And that would have been game set and match. He got too ahead of himself there, thinking how he could have made things safe. For it a bit, a bit of creativity and adventure. Nacho. Hoists it forward. That was one quality pass away from being a very decent chance. Looked very promising. Uh, that was just poor decision making and a weak execution. Good take, and he's had a look. Rudiger simply had to make that count, and he did it with some authority too. Wonderful. Caballos. Good run down the left. What can they make of it? Good clearance and very necessary. it back. Real Madrid have a simple task to find something sustained now and keep the pressure on. Clay. Pez United probably could have killed things off, but they should be okay here. He's managed to get that all wrong. Balls come loose, and the chase is on. Minutes away for what would be a huge upset. Brahim Diaz. It is just a question of running down the clock now. Tony Kroos. And it's Nacho. Lovely bit of skill. Here's Modric. So time is nearly up. One final twist, perhaps. And in time is up, and there goes the whistle. What a match, what a comeback. That is how to respond to adversity. Truly deserving winners. Jim, how do you reflect on what we've seen? Well, I have to admit, Peter, that I had this marked down as a, a draw at best, but their tactical approach and industry was superb. Many thanks to Jim, and with that, it is a very good night to you.